Hey guys, welcome to our channel. In today's video, we show you the newest fort in Sea of Thieves, the Molten Sands Fort. The fort isn't active for the moment, but we thought you might like to see what it looks like so far. We always love to battle the fort and PvP since the beginning we played Sea of Thieves. We grinded to Pirate Legend by doing forts. That's why we're very excited to see the newest fort active. Maybe there are fellow pirates who also love forts, so this video is for you guys. As you can see, the Molten Sands fort can be found in Devil's Roar. It looks like a quite big fort with its own volcano. We don't know if the volcano will also become active when the fort is. But if it will be, we think it will be a quite challenging fort because your ship will probably sink more than once by the volcano. So you'll have to return and hope no other pirates finish the fort before you. Like we all know, galleons are having it a little less hard in Devil's War than a sloop or a brigantine. So probably it will be easier when you're sailing with a galleon to finish the fort. Like you can see, there's also a volcano near the fort. But for as far as we know, the volcano doesn't reach the fort when it erupts. So your ship should be safe. We hope there will be a new kind of skeleton in the new fort. Ashen skeletons would be cool. Or something like this, made by Maximonio. Like you can see, he also made mounted skeletons and cannon skeletons. Would be cool to see something like this in-game. But Rare never mentioned something like this. Anyway, be sure to check out his artwork. Looks really awesome. You can find the link in description below the video. But for the moment this is only guessing and hoping. On the other hand, we think the geysers will make the fort a bit easier because they'll be a huge help to kill the skeletons when they spawn. So running through the geysers might make it easier. This will be the treasure room underneath the fort. We're wondering if there will only be typical Devil's Roar loot like the Ashen Bounty Skulls or if there will be something new coming along with the new fort. As you can see there are many hiding places for the solo players among us. It seems easy to hide somewhere on the island. You can climb high on the fort. You can also dash from the side of the volcano to the side of the fort. Might be handy when skeletons or rival pirates are chasing you. Or if you want to make a quick move to steal the key. But for now all of this is only guessing and waiting until the fort will be active. We don't know when that will be yet. So the only thing we can do now is wait until the developers think it's time to release a new fort to their pirates. But for the moment they're still testing it. We're really looking forward to this and hope they won't let us wait too long. What do you guys think about the new fort? And what do you expect from it? Let us know in the comments below the video. This was our video about the newest fort in Sea of Thieves. Once the fort is active, we might make a new video to show you what they made of it. And a quick guide how to complete it solo. Anyway, we hope you liked the video. If you did, make sure to give us a like. If you'd like to see more videos, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. If you're looking for fellow pirates to form a crew with, feel free to join our Discord channel. You can find the link below the video. Thanks for watching and see you next time! Shiver me timbers! Yarr. Fast,